what does a general election mean for banks, UK banks? Does it, does you know is there going to be a discount because there's a prospect of a Labour government and you know, there have been talks about you know nationalisation or or things yes. like that? There are. I don't think nationalisation of banks is frankly very likely. But at the moment, you can see that UK financial stocks, and this is insurers as well as banks, are unloved in the market, would be a polite way of putting it. <laughs> or uninvestable is another thing that people have said to me. Uh, and I think that we would see a hiatus for some time whilst an election took place, while people tried to work out what kind of government we were going to have in the future. I don't think Labour is going to go in for bank renationalisation if they were to get in. I think that they are more interested in the railways and in water, where there's much more popular support for state ownership of some kind. So I'm not particularly concerned about that. But what I am concerned about is that we have a long hiatus while the economy is declining and consumer confidence is, is weak, investment is weak. And in those circumstances, the government can't act decisively to offset a recessionary pressure. So that's the short-term risk from my perspective.